1947? Ah, the year of the Thoughter Crash. The University of Yokohama? Wow, a foreign film! Oh wait, it's Oklahoma. Sorry, false alarm. Senior prom! Fun for geriatrics! Popularity. What is it made of? I took those corn syrup and red dye 40. Lots of people and have a few close friends too. Let's watch and see what makes people like one person and not another. The loser will get slimed. There's that new girl in our math class. Oh, yes. Ow. Her name's Carolyn I told you people to stop looking at me. Why? You know her? No, I never I met her. Are you accusing me of did. something? I don't know what it is, but there's something about Why is everyone so ugly? Oh, wait, they're the pretty kids. To start with. Yeah, especially when you compare it with some of the weird characters in this place. Yoo-hoo! My yoo brings all the boys to the yard. The key to but it's actually the key to Tartarus. When Jerry brags about taking Ginny out, he learns that she dates all the boys, and he feels less important. As he should. What about Ginny? Yeah, what about Jenny? Does that make her really popular? Do the boys and girls like her? Yes. Is she welcome to join this group? Only if she puts out. Hi, Betty, Ellie. You can rest your try here, Jenny, for a minute. Thanks. What, Mississippi? Hey, Wally, how's the play coming along? The beef keeps messing it up. Jenny. You're being no, evicted. Who park in cars are not really popular. Unless they parallel not park. With the boys they park with. Hypocrites! Not when they meet at school or elsewhere. Like the local speakeasy. Nothing like being Miss Popularity. I wish I were a girl who parked yeah. in cars. Oh, yeah. Who invited Henry and a pussycat? Now there's a girl that'd really get my vote. Truman won't stand a chance in 48. Go ahead, go ahead. Now, why do they invite Carolyn to join their group? When Jenny wasn't well Because Carolyn will make a better sacrifice. Dresses? Because she seems as interested in girls as in boys? Whoa! Because they've heard no scandal about her? Yet! I guess you know everybody, don't you, Carolyn? And you know what they're all in for? Murder, arson, jaywalking, the usual. I'm Hamlet. I looked in on so yesterday. We're all in on it one way or another. So we're all liable to end up getting indicted. Two among a dozen or so. How about you, Wally? Where do you fit in all this? I have well, to keep the beaver in line. No glory attached. I gather the props together, and <laughs> boy, what a headache. Wally suffers from an underlying Could depression. I Could I lend a hand? It's a prosthetic, so you can use it for a little while. Would you really? No, because I'm a compulsive liar. I don't know anything about props, but I could learn. Lesson one, the lightsaber hilt. Hey, lay off. I saw her first. Whoa! Whoa! Is anyone going to eat this? Ha! Say, we ought to get together and talk over those props a little. Unless you want to skip straight to the necking. The height of March? I think maybe I'll take Carol into the dance Saturday night. Isn't it customary to ask a girl first? Saturday soon enough. An unused ketchup back at my lucky day. Mr. Watson, come here. I want to see you. Hello? Stu, if you hang up, I will Hello, kill Wally. you. I, I was wondering if you'd like to go to the Strand to see a movie Saturday night. It's an educational it's short about okay. popularity. Well, yes, I... Should Wally be concerned that she just trailed off like that? Skating party and weenie roast. Tonight, the we Friars Club roasts Mr. Weenie. But we get home at a decent time. Around 11 a.m. or so. Skating sounds like loads of fun. I'll bring my blades. Wally has used a lot of common sense in putting the invitation this way. It She'll never see the proposal coming. Might like. And he has implied his price range, so she will have some idea of what he can afford when she makes her choice. Ah, physically responsible Carol love. It's so pragmatically beautiful. It's doing the girl no favor to leave it entirely up to her. Unless she likes to dominate, in which case leave it entirely up to her. Wally, on Saturday at 5 then. Bye. Well, that phone call didn't go on for hours. But it sure felt Very that way. Attitude toward telephone conversations. It's to invent texting ASAP. Carolyn keeps a date calendar. A personal oh, analog yeah. assistant. She'll never have the embarrassment of forgetting a date. Unless she forgets or to check her calendar. An hour too late. Was this part written by Zakora? Hey! Hmm. That's a good note to write yourself. Remember Any to feed night. Tarantula. But especially when you're getting ready for a date. 
Spin around ten times and try looking at that wallpaper. There. You too can do a manicure, Ellie. No more Guinness World Record fingernails for you. Tonight if I only knew if Bill's dug up transportation to the dam. You sure he knew to phone you here at my house? I told him three times. In a dream. I'll have to be getting home to dinner pretty soon. Mom's making you naggy. Take my advice. Think twice before you start going steady. Try playing the field. Like Jenny. Nope. Well, don't you ever want to? All the time. Yes, I do. I never know what he's planned. He just says, will you decide, Ellie? I should think you'd run out of ideas. Well, I'm getting to that point. Soon there won't be an idea left. Yay! I guess it's done. Bushy, bushy. Oh, Daddy? Okay. Baku Hatsudeska? I love you, Carolyn. <clears throat> Jerry. I'll have to ask my boyfriend. What you have in mind? Whenever you can find a time to park in my car. Good grief. I'm awfully sorry, but I have a date for tonight, Jerry. Everything that Tomorrow? has transpired here has no, done so I'm according sorry. to my design. Well, call me early next week, Jerry. <sighs> my name is George. Why does everyone keep calling That's me Jerry? Goodbye. Wah, wah, wah. <laughs> Your friends up there on the you sanctuary live? moon are walking into a trap, as is your rebel fleet. Sounds like you're asking her so late went over like a lead balloon, brother. You really Maybe stepped so. in it this time, brother. Well, let's see what else we can do about tonight. Any atomic tests planned oh, for tonight? Isn't too promising for Jerry. George! But after all, it's no compliment to any girl to call her so late she thinks she's a very last resort. You really are a Sometimes piece of work, I aren't you? to get ready for a date. Apparently, they're saying it was just a weather balloon. Heh <laughs> heh huh? I'm not buying it. Hello, Wally. Come on in. This, this is the coldest June I've ever seen. Gee, look at y'all. All ready and right on time, too. That's a good deal. Punctuality is sexier than oh, lingerie. Just trying to hold this sham marriage together, dear. This is Wally Johnson. Well... This had better be important if you're pulling me away from Prince Valiant. I suppose this is Wally. As long as you're not a Bolshevik, dear, we'll get along just fine. Oh, excuse me a second. I forgot my scarf. I'll be right there. By scarf, she actually means a mace, so don't get any ideas, boy. Too late for that. I was just looking into the world of events before we go to dinner. I tricked him into taking me out tonight. Manipulation is the key to any successful marriage. They come to life at night, ma'am. Much as I hate to admit it, though, Carolyn has hunted down a lot of things that we couldn't find any place. Light ammunition, mostly. Where's the scarf? We were promised the scarf. I made some brownies today. Maybe you and Wally would like some when you get back. There's some milk in the icebox, too, isn't there? How does that sound? Gee, that sounds good. Just a G, we'll no G whiz. What is wrong with your generation? Carolyn and her mother have found one way a girl can repay a boy for entertaining her. Whoa! A bite to eat at her house will save him money. Perhaps they'll bring another couple home with them. Whoa! Folks know when we'll be home? We'll be home before 11, Mother. Hey, I'm a PM, dear. And Carolyn are saved the embarrassment of the arguments about coming in at night. Through mind control. Settled before Wally arrived. The hour was decided after considering such things as where Carolyn and Wally are going on their date, whether tomorrow is a school day, and how many dates she has had recently. The whole yeah, process yeah. involves differential calculus. The family knows Carolyn will stick to her word. Because they have dirt oh. on her. Have fun, you two. I'll take good care of her, Mrs. Ames. That's what Bye. he said just a few minutes prior to Carolyn's conception. Bye. Wally felt at ease with Carolyn's parents and will be eager to return to her home. Unlikely. They liked him, too. Comparatively. <laughs> he is proud to be with Carolyn because she looks well. Wait, Friends she looks everyone, good or she sees well? Their feelings. She likes him for these same reasons. And also because he is fun to be with. And because he doesn't Home, smell like cheap body spray. All help boys and girls to be popular. But throwing some money at the situation doesn't hurt either. Must become popular.